Chanel Brown from Sister Wives has become a fan favorite. And y'all, the way she is setting her foot down and letting Cody know who she is and what she will not tolerate. The way she is basically spelling out what she needs, hilarious to me. Highly, highly respectful. Let me tell you something. That is very inspiring, motivating. Yes, ma'am, Janelle. You better let him know. You better let Robin know, too. And she's letting fans know all about my sister wife's claws. <laughs> the jewelry line. OMG. Y'all. The Ashley's Reality Roundup. Exclusively reported sister wife star Janelle Brown reveals why her family's jewelry line, my sister wife's closet, failed <laughs> miserably. The only thing that was more of a disaster than my sister wife's closet was my marriage to Cody. Ooh, no, she didn't, child. She went there. The Brown family's dream of being the premier jewelry supplier for polygamous women across America failed miserably. And in a recent interview, Janelle Brown gave an update on the family's ill-fated line, my sister wife's closet, and offered her thoughts on why the jewelry company crashed and burned so badly. As long-time Sister Wives fans will remember, Cody Brown, Janelle, and Cody's other wives, Mary, Robin, and Christine, attempted to launch a My Sister Wife's Closet years ago. The online jewelry line, which was spearheaded by Robin, featured jewelry and clothing pieces designed by Cody and Company. And, despite it being featured heavily on several seasons of Sister Wives, never seemed to gain enough traction to be successful. During an interview with the Reality Life with Kate Casey podcast posted this week, Janelle actually discussed the family's failed jewelry company and all of the unsold Sister Wives themed merchandise. <laughs> Y'all, I kid not. I kid not. Look at how they promoted it back in the day. Knowing this was Robin, don't miss tonight's episode of Sister Wives. View one of Robin's new design. <laughs> Boy, they thought they thought it was going somewhere Robin did. It wasn't successful, Janelle said of the jewelry line. I do think that we probably didn't know how to run a business as a family together. It probably should have been more of an individual thing in retrospect. Janelle, who is four who of the four sister wives seemed the least interested in making the jewelry company happen said she has no idea what happened to all the unsold inventory of polygamy heart pendants and loyalty necklaces and whatnot. I've been so removed from that business. I have no idea, she added. I believe, isn't Robin still selling this jewelry? Curious, I'm asking. The website for the jewelry line is still active. Oh, thank you for answering my question, girl. But the last time the blog section was updated was January of 2019 when Robin posted a blog about friendship. That inspired her to create a weird dog tag pendant. Back in March 2023, Cody's daughter, McKelty, discussed the jewelry line on her Patreon. She stated that while Robin was still open to orders for the merchandise, the company's website was a frequent target of hackers. It became too much to continuously repair the website to keep up with it, McKelty said. Just a couple of months ago, I asked Robin about it, and she said she's still taking orders. <laughs> I bet she is. But I think Robin is the only one that does the My Sister Wife's Closet. <clears throat> I bet she is. And she has been for the last couple of years. Later in the interview, Janelle, who left Cody several years ago and now resides in North Carolina, away from him and Robin, discussed how nice it is that she no longer has to go with family projects or consider what everyone else wants. I have a lot more say over what I do, she told Kate Casey. I had to always consider everybody else's opinion, the whole family. And it's nice to sort of move forward into what I want to do and not have to think about them. So I think I'm bolder than I was in the very beginning of Sister Wives. Janelle also discussed her new passion project business that she plans to open with her daughter Madison and Caleb. The trio recently announced that they are going to open a flower farm in North Carolina called Tata Farms, a business very much unlike my sister wife's closet in that Janelle is very excited about. 
Uh, very telling that Robin is still taking orders. <laughs> Knowing she ain't giving them other women no kind of sort of profit. But hey, they have all admitted, all the women, they have all said, look, I didn't have nothing to do with that. That was Robin. So, I mean, that kind of is saying, you know, I don't want nothing to do with that. <laughs> now, I don't see it being successful just because Robin's not a very good business person. She's not a very good marketing person. I don't think, I don't see her trying to advertise I don't see her posting anything about anything, okay? I don't see her having fans out there. If she does, it, it they very few and far between, okay? Very few and far between. It's like finding a needle in a haystack, trying to find a fan of Robin's. I mean, seriously. Seriously. It's like uh, Robin's fan literally is a needle in a haystack. Where's Waldo? You catch what I'm throwing. You know what else you could catch? You could catch a brand new episode of Sister Wives that airs this Sunday exclusively on TLC at 9 p.m. Central Standard Time. Set your DVRs, mark your calendars. I really hope you like and share this video. And please subscribe. If you're new here, I hope you subscribe. I love you so much for watching. I will see you in my next video or in the comments below.